Hello, T Fingerboards here. Um, this video will be going on my YouTube. This video will be going on my YouTube. What? Well, in this video, we're gonna be. I gotta turn off the TV. I just turn off the TV. I just. I'm not gonna turn it off and take take off what's playing. But we'll, I'll just leave it on because that's how the LED is on. So. We got this old tap deck I got when I bought a bunch of fingerboards off Facebook Marketplace. It's pretty cool, I guess. It's a JB graphic. I'm pretty sure. I don't really know what company it is in real life. <laughs> but, yeah, it's an old tap deck. I had it set up a while ago. It kind of sucks. What am I saying? It sucks. It sucks egg. So, this is pretty much a dude setup I got. Just a doo doo set up, like, like my mom made doo doo for dinner set up. So we are gonna be upgrading it into a pretty good feeder board. I'm gonna put some good parts on it. So I will cut. Well, actually, no, I'll go get my grip tape. So, like, I am still here. Just I'm gonna go get the grip tape because I don't know where it is. Uh, um, um. I don't know where my grip tape is. I had it. It's just right here on my desk. All right, we got this tape I got off Amazon. And my mom bought it for me because she'll be real nice that day. And she got it for me. I'm, I'm not saying she's not, not nice any other day. But she's a very good mother and she got me this. So I'm like, oh, she's a very good mother. It's professional foam grip. Like, I can literally do, like, a kick flip on this. I'm over exaggerating, you know? I'm not even sure if we'll be able to put this on this deck because it, it's like inside. So this will be part one and it will cut to part two when I'm done. Shoot. When I'm done peeling it off. Actually, nah. I'll just leave it how it is on right now. You can just watch me peel it off. Oh, and this is 26 millimeters wide, by the way. To peel it off. Just complete silence. There we go, there we go. We got it. Oh, there's this little piece that we left on. That is very clean. Ah, uh, I was expecting it to leave like those little like sticker marks that normally happens whenever you cut, take off the. the I'm literally stuttering. I'm gonna go get scissors to cut the grip tape. If it ends up a doo doo job for the grip tape, I'm not surprised. So, put this right here. Just cut because then we could use the rest of it to make it st stop a obstacle from moving because, well, that's annoying. So I'll place it on right now. I really hope this is thick enough, wide enough. If you hear my dad, he's on a phone call. So if you hear like a goofball screaming, that's what it is. If you hear like, hey, 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 how are you doing? All right, that is pretty good. Oh, you know what? Uh, I'll go check out FB Christopher's new video. It's called Tech Deck Pro Series Unboxing and Review 2023. How? Bro, FB Christopher, if you happen to somehow find my account and find this video, where? Do I find a Tech Deck Pro Series? 
I really want to get one of those, and my birthday is coming up in a bit, so I can ask my parents to get me one for my birthday, or my sister, or my friend. That sounds real, like, oh, I could ask him to get it for me. Oh, yeah, like, that sounds like, like the Disney, Disney, old Disney film bully named, like, Samantha or something, or, like, Mallory. Yeah, I'm using a nail file. You want to rub down. I... When you're done, to smooth it out a bit, do this, but softly. Don't go, like, full-on strength. Guess what happened, guys? Uh, So, I I went to Walmart with my parents, and I found this sheet, big sheet of foam grip tape. And I bought it, but it wasn't for fingerboards, so it was literal just... I'm not kidding, because for Christmas, I got uh my LC board set up. This is not the LC board set up, but this is my slash code set up. It had the same type of grip as this. And I was like, damn, this is grippy as hell compared to my construction foam tape that feel like bull crap. Alright. Oh, that is so satisfying. Alright, now we're gonna smooth it in and out. The top right here. I just realized the entire camera angle was just like in the corner so that sucks man i can't be able to record this video again i swear yeah, if this gets zero views in the first day i am not surprised man uh yeah so we got that done so far now what i would recommend for punching holes in because as you can see right here there are little holes it like you need to put holes there so you could put the trucks on what i would recommend to use to put those trucks on would be a push pin and only push pin because the tech deck tools are very skinny oh guys got so i found this tech deck tool laying around the other day but it's so neat because the tech deck tools normally they're like this small and you have to like tighten it and it like doesn't tighten because your hands are all sweaty and it's plastic but this is like the same material the Tech Deck trucks are made out of. See these trucks? It's the same type of material. Just a bit, like, rougher. Oh, yeah. I'm going to make a video on explaining how to upgrade a Tech Deck. And this is the Tech Deck I upgraded. So, yeah, pretty neat. Pretty neat. I can't get any shakes because there's no fire. Anymore. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure this video will have, like, three parts because... I want my videos to be at least five minutes long. And this video is already eight minutes long. So, I'm going to punch the holes and then I'll... you have to watch part two. Because I don't want this to be 20 minutes of one video. Just like, you know. Right, i got a push pin right here. What I would recommend is pushing from the bottom and then up like this. Then you do this. Not just from the bottom, because then it will mess up the grip and it'll look real weird. Wait, I'm going to turn on my light. I only have my LED on. Oh my god, they're bright. Six tray truck you Trudeau shirt. Alright, so. um, I don't even know where I punched the hole. I don't even know where I punched the hole. I can't see it. Bro, I can't see that. I also got to take, take a piss real badly, so I'm just going to punch the holes, and then it'll go to part two. I might film that tomorrow or right now. Like, I don't know, because I might have to do eat dinner. So. All right, you, you definitely can't see those holes, so I'm going to try to use the tech deck tool I have. Well, this isn't a tech deck tool. I, it didn't come from a tech deck, so. Yeah, it just doesn't fit. So we're gonna have to keep on using this. All right, yeah, it's gonna cut to part two now. So this, just cut to part two. I hope you enjoy my video. 
Watch part two. We'll be releasing very soon on how to upgrade a tech deck. I'm just upgrading a 26 millimeter old tech deck. And if you're wondering what trucks I'll be using, they're Braille trucks. So, see ya. Ba-da-bum-bum-ba-dum-bum.